Welcome everybody. Welcome to today's lesson on Start Pro Connect Edition. Today we shall be talking about P Delta analysis. Now, P Delta analysis can be is also known as second order analysis. Now, for buildings where there's vertical load and lateral load on the columns, it's going to display like this. So imagine a building with the normal gravity load and let's assume lateral load like wind load. So you, the column is going to displace like this and there's going to be another additional moment from this um, vertical load. So let's go to start pro and use P delta analysis. Give it the name you want, P delta. Choose your location, unit, metric. So create job. Okay. First thing we do is draw our column. The height of our column is 10 meters. Okay. So next thing, the member is from node 1 to node 2. Okay. So after that, we we'll assign property. So since it is a slender column, I'm going to use 0 0.23 by 0 0.23. So 0 0.23 and 0 0.23. Okay. So add, close, assign to view, assign to view. Next thing is my support, create support fixed add okay assign to node one node one this is node one so if you want to see what node one is go to labels node numbers apply okay so this is one this is two next thing is my loading now my loading i'm going to have the vertical and horizontal loads so load one is vertical sorry vertical and load two is horizontal Uh, close so the vertical load is on node one is fy and that is minus 15 add close so use this one to edit to node two add next one is the horizontal load so let me edit it well l change okay add next thing we go to is nodal loads so in the x direction it's going in the x direction so a positive five add close so edit node two also okay so now the next thing i do is to combine this load i'm going to repeat the load so click here that will be vertical plus horizontal sorry horizontal okay add close then click this you add it then there's you come to your left hand side you see something they call repeat load so repeat load so you bring out these two loads bring them out so factor one then you add okay so when you add you see this and you can close okay next thing you do is analysis define command what type of analysis do you want so we are working on p delta analysis so click p delta analysis number of iteration i will explain to you that on the next video book tick small delta okay so add close then run the analysis save okay zero errors zero one zero notes so let's go to our post processing okay so now first moment reaction select your text cursor to bring the box up text cursor so our reaction now it's vertical so we have zero this is it next one is the horizontal now you can see the horizontal we have 50 which is actually five this horizontal that was five times 10 the height that was why like we got 50. so let's see the combination vertical plus horizontal so as you can see the p delta moment at the end of the day is now 55.523 kilonewton meter so thank you for watching today's video on start pro connect uh, on p delta analysis please make sure you subscribe and if you have any question please drop it in the uh, in the comment section thank you very much